So today, I'm recording this on April 4th, has been four months since she passed away. And these last four months have been so weird. They, you know, the first, I would say, two months have felt like just kind of doing the necessary stopping medical services, you know, telling the medical supply company we didn't need any more food supplies. And, you know, having to deal with things like her equipment company calling me and telling me that after a nine month wait that her stroller was finally ready, her new wheelchair was finally ready and having to tell her we don't need it anymore. God, that sucked. (laughs) And then there would be days where just all hit me and I couldn't think about things in the same way. And grief had really like taken away some of my ability to think clearly. I thought you know, I was doing okay. (laughs) And then like everything started to come to the surface. Everything that just didn't have space yet to be addressed was bubbling up. So a lot of grief, a lot of anger, the places that have been the safe houses for anger or sadness or grief for a lot of things in my life were 